And let's stay in the area of uh, uh, document line translations and recognition. We have uh, for a while had the purchase line translation uh, possibilities to translate the recognized number and description values. Um, and that is now also possible for sales documents. So when you have a document, a PDF from a, a customer, that you want to uh, register as a sales order, we can now translate uh, the number and description using filters and wildcards. An example here for the number field, if you want to translate the content in the number field, it could be like uh, it, it begins with a 10, so it says 10 asterisks, or it contains specific values like freight or transport, then these, these translation examples would be something that you could fill in into the number field translation. And the same goes for the description field, that you can fill in a, a value like uh, uh, it could contain the word table, uh, or the specific value harbor lounge chair. So depending on what the description says or the number uh, it contains, then we uh, can do these translations for both sales and purchase lines when we recognize them in Dogma Capture. Besides this uh, uh, addition to the sales documents, we generally improve the line translation methods. So when you have a new line recognized where you need to translate it, to translate account, have Dogma Capture apply the account through translation, then um, you are now notified in the bottom with a bit more information. You can now see the values in the number column and the description column, um, guiding you to what is possible to translate by, so you can easily um, get an overview of what you should do and what is missing. <laughs> 